Listen, all I want is a trial balance software that will let me do four things. One, adjustments, book and tax. Two, groupings, book and tax, bonus points if it'll do consolidations. Three, tax software import because I don't wanna have to key all that stuff in. And four, I want it for a reasonable price. Is that too much to ask? We'll see. Let's run through 13 different options for trial balance software because number one, just using the accounting software doesn't cut it for me, bub. For all but the most simple books, the tax books are different than the books that management wants to see or if they have to issue gap reports. I need my trial balance app to post tax adjustments and run those grouped reports for tax. And people are gonna fight me on this, but Excel isn't gonna cut it. <laughs> when you have to post a whole ton of adjustments, when you need to run grouped reports for tax or God forbid consolidate several companies, even with a bunch of Excel sorcery, you're doing a pile of manual work and then it's gotta get into the tax software. I just, I don't, I just, I, I'm, I'm not, I don't, I don't want to key it all in, okay? And if you're like me, you came of age with this beauty, ATB, Accountant's Trial Balance. Evidently images of this program no longer exist on the internet, but it came in a number of flavors. Light 3.0, right up, there were modules, even a conversion utility. It was first launched in 1988 by, drum roll please, the AICPA in partnership with into it. What? Now, if you never used ATB, I can't describe to you just how perfect it was. It was perfect. And it was truly the golden age of accounting in the early 90s, as proven by this 1996 article in the Journal of Accountancy announcing an ATB update requiring four megabytes of RAM, and that George Lucas's special effects company, Industrial Light and Magic, made a commercial for the AICPA. ILM, the same people behind Star Wars, Indiana Jones and Howard the Duck. No more Mr. Yeah. Nice Duck. And by all accounts, the commercial, it really slapped. <laughs> the commercial will go on to win a number of awards and the AICPA eventually extended their deal with ILM to produce a second commercial the next year. But all good things come to an end. And in December of 1998, the AICPA sold ATB to a company called CSI, who went on to shut down the program, ending support entirely in 2003. But accountants, they are nothing if not resilient. You can find entire threads of tax pros online clear up to 2017 hacking together ways to get 64-bit windows to run ATB, which apparently only worked on 32-bit operating systems. Causing new users to ask completely reasonable questions like, I was a little surprised this software is still in use. And while many of us are still living in denial, it's probably time to move on to more modern solutions. And one company has unashamedly taken up the ATB namesake, 10 Key ATB. And as far as I can tell, they don't actually have any ties to the original app, but are a cloud-based trial balance utility. The accountants, trial balance of the future, used by over 1,000 CPAs worldwide. Enrolled agents need not apply. Oh. Looks like it does journal entries, groupings, financial statements, with some integrations between Ledger apps and tax software, depending on what package you buy. And it starts at just 500 bucks annually. Up next, you may have seen this one around, Tally4. This one comes with a whole bunch of integrations. It started out as just a trial balance utility, but is now getting into work paper management and even some like light tax planning strategy stuff. Right now it starts at 750 bucks a year. I'll put links to all these down in the video description, by the way. Number six, once accounting, a past participant in the AICPA Startup Accelerator, their approach is to be connected to all of your clients' ledgers year round. So you can just hop into a single place and see live updating trial balances for all of your clients. If you've ever had to track down financials from a client to do like tax planning mid-year, you know how handy that could be, having access to all that stuff year round. Up next, Regroup Tax. Another past participant in the AICPA Startup Accelerator integrates with QBO and Zero, and it's a cloud-based trial balance tool. Pretty cheap, starts at 60 bucks a month, and you may be realizing by now, it's actually really hard to tell like one of these things from the other. Most tools have a couple YouTube videos where you can see them in use online, but the devil is probably in the details, and I would love to crowdsource some feedback from you here in the comments. Let me know what you use, whether you like it, whether you don't like it, and then folks can cruise through those comments to get some insights from actual, like, real accountant users. Mm, you just want crap. Mm, desktop till I die. Please share that experience below. It'd be super helpful. Number eight, Quick Trial Balance Pro by the company Proware, people behind Asset Keeper, if you ever use that one. This one is the top ranking Google search result for trial balance software for accountants. As far as I can tell, it's desktop based. The features page is a PDF. You can buy it for 400 bucks, which entitles you to install it on every computer in your office. And I know your next question 
but what about laptops that are used at the client's location? I have good news for you. Right there, yep. Remember how buying software used to be? Uh, this one looks like it's kind of trying to be ATB. The main thing you lose today with desktop tools is you're generally gonna not have the integrations into QBO and Zero and your cloud-based ledgers. Now surely that's all of them, right? You would be wrong. Trial Balance Pro, my eyes! My eyes! What are we doing here? Why are you still watching this? This is why kids won't go into accounting. It's simply the best trial balance software you will ever use. A quote from, from no one in particular. Copyright 2018, get five computer installations for the low, low price of $349. Windows version now available. What could that mean? How about TB Works? It's an easy trial balance accounting software, desktop and cloud versions if you swing both ways, only 400 bucks a year for the desktop version and unlimited users, with the cloud version being 500 bucks a year per five users. Balanceware, the next generation trial balance software. You got TBFS Writer, and then this one doesn't even have a name, but it's brought to you by the people responsible for this landing page. And I would like to take, take a moment to thank, nope, not an ad. I'd like to thank the lovely people building great modern solution for the accounting profession, many of whom advertise on this channel. Still not an ad. But good gravy, does the accounting profession need either a fresh injection of developers or, uh, or AI to just give us a fundamentally better way to do all of this stuff? Now, I know many of us are begrudgingly using the trial balance utility that is attached to your work paper solution or your tax software. Apps such as Engagement Cloud Trial Balance, Engagement Desktop Trial Balance, Caseware, Work Paper CS, Advanced Flow, Envio Trial Balance, they're all pretty meh. So much so that actually three of those were built by the same company. The people who made those tools got to the end of making them and thought, yeah, let, let's give it another go. I started writing this video with the goal of putting together something helpful. And I'm not sure ultimately whether or not it will be, but I did stumble into another lesson. And it is that, that life is short. And there are things in our lives that will be taken from us, oftentimes unfairly. And you won't realize until it is too late what you had. You know, on my Mount Rushmore of software, I have QuickBooks desktop, Excel, 3D Space Cadet, and ATB. And maybe it's the day quilt talking, but nothing makes me appreciate great software like shitware. And I'm not saying all the apps we looked at today are shitware. A few of them aren't. But what I am saying is accountants need great software. And it's hard to attract developers to our space for the same reason it's hard to attract bright-eyed, impressionable young Zoomers. But if you're willing to put up, if you're willing to put up with us weirdos, developers, Welcome to the land of opportunity. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a wrap. Thank you. That felt good. That was, what did you do? Is that good?